Hello, my lovely trail bites and fossil fam. This just came in the mail. This is, I got it. My friend told me they got me this for my birthday. It's the ice cream box. And I have no idea what's in it. And we're going to unbox it together. Hopefully I didn't just give you all the spoilers, but I didn't read that. So, cool. So if you don't want spoilers, I'd watch this later. But I actually don't know what's in here either. So, okay. First off is a... Gerard Cosmetics. I think it's just like a white eye primer base. Next we have, I have no idea how to pronounce that word. Oh, I'm think I went like one word, not so rich. My brain went like sork. A glow light. I'm not sure if this is supposed to be like an eyeshadow topper or what. What else is in here? Chantico Beauty. Whoa. Kaleidoscopic Multichrome Eyeshadow. Oh, that's <laughs> that's definitely interesting. That's really creamy. I've never heard of some of these brands. Have you heard of these? I've never I've heard of like Gerard, but I haven't heard of Whoa, that's got some kick to it. Okay, <laughs> what else is in here? Um, ZC, I've heard of ZC, but I've never tried it. Is that a planet? <gasps> I love planets. Okay, so Discovery Velvet Lip Creme. In the shade X03. Oh my gosh. No, I've never tried ZC or Gerard Cosmetics or So Rich or Seriously. Oh my gosh, it's like a little planet. <laughs> Let's see what color this is. Oh, I guess this comes off so you can like put it on different ones. That's exciting. That's a good fall color. I've never tried ZC. That color. And then what else is in here? We have, I guess, the palette of... Oh, look at that. That is so adorable. It's like little mushrooms. I really like Smurfs, so that's adorable. The Secret Garden by Gourmand Girls and Ice Cream Beauty. Okay, let's see what this looks like. Wow, I really hope that's not a press glitter. Okay, I feel like I have to swatch this because I need to know if that's a pressed glitter or not. And I have I have to know. <laughs> I have to know. Like this this is an integral part of this. So and this is really, really cute packaging. I've never tried this brand either. So I'm excited to do that. Let's see. Real quick. The Secret Grove palette by Gourmand Girls. It retails for $30, I think, but 10 mattes, two shifty duochromes, one glitter and one shimmer. But if they're duo, is it, uh, we're still under, okay. All right, so I'm just gonna swatch away. 
never tried this formula, so you'll have to let me know if it's any good or not. If you like it or if you've tried it. Because I'm very intrigued. Especially, I really hope that green isn't like... These are dry swatches, so... Like this red is gonna stain me <laughs> like a lot. It's definitely what I think of when I think of fall. I think it's just missing like a bright purple or something. Maybe we'll get there. Maybe we'll find a purple. Is this supposed to be one of those shimmery duochromes? Okay, I really, maybe I just put that in too hard. Oh, that's really pretty. It's like a green to pink shift. Ow! I mean, that one's a little peachy and that one's yellow, but these are, they're kind of close. <laughs> I'm hoping this green is a lot different than the other ones. Those two greens look really similar. Okay, those greens are very, very similar. <laughs> That's kind of disappointing. I would have preferred they had a lot more differentiation. That's some neon pink there. These have to, these are a little little chunky. These are a little, little chunky. It's not exactly a glitter. It just, you kind of have to like warm it up a bit and get it in there. You definitely use a glitter primer with that. That would be a definitive glitter primer moment. That's a really, really cute palette. I just wish these colors were a little bit more different and those two were a little bit more different. Okay, so I want to swatch this one like really good right here. Just to see like, okay, they're not exactly the same, but they are very, very, very similar. Now we're gonna the yellow. Next to this one, just so I can see the difference. There is a little bit of difference. I would prefer that they, if they had like, like a really, really dark green or, you, you know, well, I guess they do have a dark green. I would have preferred that one of these you know, even be like a green shimmer. Like one of these be a duochrome green shimmer. That way I could do like multiple things with it instead of just having two mattes that are so similar. Especially when I blend them out, it's gonna look almost identical. These have a little bit more difference with like the yellow and the peach, but still, I don't think that's enough like depth or variation for my preference but it does have light shades and go to pretty darn dark and I really do like the greens except the two that match but I I wear a lot of green so I guess that's okay and the pink is just kind of an odd thing I would have rather seen like an like a lighter plum or something like another purple as opposed to like a bright pink but overall, not bad. I think the packaging's really cute, and I've never tried this brand before, and it came in a birthday box. So 
if your box contained the same thing let me know or if you ordered this and you're waiting for it to come in um let me know and i'm very excited that i have a planet that goes on my lippy and this duochrome is actually really interesting too so and i do want to try this eye base i think that'll be really nice so yeah let me know if you picked this up or if it's arrived and i will continue my declutter and petri dish later on this week so thank you for watching please like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one okay bye